This is happening. Yep. Oh, hey, and... We're not getting any audio on our end. No? Ah. Are we not? Oh, okay. Well, that's good. Now we should be hearing something soon. Yeah. <laughs> I am genius. I am great in the background. Yep. So Robotic makes a giant planet space station. Sure. That he has the money to make. Um, that's that's actually pretty funny. I don't understand how he has the money to do this and not already have control of the world. Because that's fucking insane. Yeah, maybe he has like energy to matter manipulation or something. Look at this shit though, like. That or he does like all his shopping at Costco. Most likely. Yeah. He's been saving up for a couple years. Yeah. Buying in bulk. So we have normal looking people. They're not that normal looking. Compared to say Robotnik. Oh, Robotnik showed up. Editor. Yeah. Okay, so I guess Robotnik is going to take over the world. The moon is gone. Yeah. Sure. Eggman. Oh, that creep never I think he's gone a little bit past creep. Is this in the same universe as Unleashed? Energy. Yes. So the moon gets better? Yeah. The okay. I'm pretty sure it's in the same universe as Unleashed. Tails? Maybe not. Maybe it's not. Tails, how long have you been there? <laughs> I, I've, I've been here the whole time, Sonic. I, you know, Actually, it might I had a not mech be. thing. I, I, I blew up some I robots. I think Unleashed it's is after 06, and 06 is a reboot. What is wrong with her eyelash? It's if part think, of her eye. If you think these character models are bad, you need to see the original Dreamcast character models. They're terrible. <laughs> that was a weird run. Uh, I mean, Amy's fast. Amy is like Tails fast. Oh, not Tails really. Again. Sonic Team. Sonic Team? Yeah, it's a billboard. Okay. Hooray! You did it. I'm in the part of the game that plays itself. Eh. They're fun. It's. Yeah, it's no, I'm not complaining. Around. This is way better than the Knuckles stuff. Yeah, I told you. The Knuckles you. stuff could be so cool if I, it I used, told like, you. <laughs> you know, gaming conventions that make sense. The fact that they're randomized is fucking silly. Actually, I have no issue with them being randomized. It's that... Um... The clues suck? The clues are terrible, that is true. I think with a better clue Ooh. system... It doesn't matter. Oh, uh, you're at half health, so... Right. Oh, right. Coins don't heal me in this one. Yeah. I think that does, though. Yeah. Nice. Sure. What do you want? Yep. Earthquakes. I really like the design of this level, actually. You're also wanted with a reward of one million. Not one million dollars, cool. just one million. Can I fly? No. Can't fly. But you can jump down. Yeah. This section actually reminds me a ton huh. of um, first level Mega Man X. Way? You do need to go that way. And now you can fly. Neat. Yeah. I have a booster. It allows you to hover when you hold down A button during a jump. So this, like, just the design of this area Wait. reminds me a lot of Mega Man X's open. What do you got? Too far to jump across. Oh well, yeah, maybe if you're a coward. Really, that goes. Oh, okay. You did it. Generic crush machine. Die. Okay. Jump on it. Jump on it. Jump on it. Wait. Uh, 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 uh. I miss the 90s, Peter. Is that how that song went? No. I was doing okay. a different song in my head. Okay. Don't worry about it. Blow up the bombs. Okay. With those, the oh, those are the bombs. You did it. Neat. You what, did what it. It's just to help you get up. Bomb robots. Try locking onto bombs and robots. Okay. <laughs> okay. So get ready to see Tails' internal strength and power. You never realized how buff Tails was in the past, Peter. Internal strength and power? Yeah. And external. Look at that shit. Oh. Look at that shit. <laughs> yeah, that's nicely done. I guess that makes sense. Kind of in a 
<laughs> okay. <laughs> Try this again. Third time's a charm. Okay. Yeah. Wait. Slowly moving platforms. Yeah, Sonic. Sonic level. Because when I think of Sonic game, I think of having to wait around and not do anything for a while. I mean, kind of. Really? Kind of. I Depending on the Sonic. Think Actually, of... when I think of Sonic game nowadays, I think of slow paced bad piece of shit. Ah. Because most of them don't work at the speed they're supposed to, so you have to go slow so you don't die. Sure. Sure, that's a fun thing to yeah. put right there. Yeah. Okay. Why do you uh, keep blowing up the signs? What did they ever do to you? They know. There's a uh, missile back behind you. Oh, uh, okay. Oh my god! Just start walking backwards and it'll fix itself. You say that. It did. See? Nice call. Boom! Why was there just a bunch of cages set up in the middle of the street? No. Robots. Don't ask questions. Just shooting at you. Can I? Oh. You hit a bomb power up to kill them all. Neat. I guess. Nice, nice, nice. You got this. There we go. Get all those points Ooh. that matter. Yeah. Did you ever care about high scores in video games that weren't in the arcade? No. I like oftentimes didn't even care at the arcade. In the arcade, though, there's a little bit, like, it's at least there's back and forth with other people at the arcade, you know? Sure. But, like, at home, like, who's there checking your high score? Not a lot. Ooh, you're good. It, it always felt weird to me. I Is think... there a bomb around here to hit somewhere, please? Just avoid them. Can I see them? Like, I don't know. It felt like such an archaic thing. I don't... I really think score has much to do in most video games nowadays. I agree. That being uh, said, online like leaderboards have made it better. Sure. I want to do something specifically cool. But like, um, Splunky has a cool thing where there's an achievement for getting uh, as few there. points as possible. It's like a minimalist run where you have to have no money and no points. It's it's a good huh. run. It's interesting. Yeah, it's a good way to go about it. But in this game, they're completely pointless. Yeah. Yeah. Pointless. Exactly. Out some <laughs> stuff that this much shit matter. just exploding everywhere. Yeah, hey, blow huh. up the wanted signs. Neat. Didn't Be a criminal. That was a thing. Uh... Just be on top of them. And they Are should they come, back come back. Up. They should. Move it more forward. Huh. That's strange. I don't think that's working as intended. Huh. Maybe. There's a little sheep there. I uh, need to find all of the sheep, Peter. I'm good. Why don't you care about the sheep? I wonder what the yellow means. Um, I think a certain amount of coins will heal you slowly. Well, it changed camera angles on me as I was doing that. That was fun. Hmm. Which also changed the direction in which I was moving. Hmm. Hmm, what? I'm trying to figure this out. I guess that works. Yeah. Okay. okay. I'm Tails. Hooray. Oh, shit. When are we going to play Double Dash, Peter? I don't know. That okay reminded me of fucking Daisy. I hate Daisy. I hate Daisy so much. But you hide it so well. I hate her with a passion. I'm just going to Yeah. Nicely done. Good recovery. Um, Precision platforming in a mech. You can do it. Use your boosters. To get up? Use your boosters. No? There you go. That's weird. That's weird. Got it. Got it. Okay, so okay. why does this skybox look pretty decent compared to the Pumpkin Hill one, which looked like a literal pile of garbage. I don't know. Like, the Pumpkin Hill one was terrible resolution. I'm not budgeting. crazy, right? I'm gonna go with budgeting. <laughs> uh, why did that happen? I don't know. 
<laughs> I don't know most uh, of why this game does anything it does. <laughs> oh man. Shit, game developing back in the 90s must have been fun as hell. When there were no rules and you'd get money no matter how well you did? Yeah, basically. I mean, that still happens nowadays with any of the mainstream games. Just put Royale at the end of something and you get money. I don't know, I mean, like, the Royale concept has a really cool concept to it, I think. Yeah, but people are throwing it in everything. It's in MOBAs now. There's a Is MOBA it? Battle Right now has a PvP... I, I don't know Battle Right. It's a MOBA, but it has a PvP Battle Royale mode now. Neat. Is it? Sure. I mean, if it's what people want, then it's what people want. That's... I don't know. I think it's just people are buying into a fad real fast because it's the current money maker. I would keep moving forward. Uh, I have a couple hits from death. So yeah, I'm but waiting. like waiting... I feel like you're going to avoid more enemies by going forward quickly than by waiting back to let them shoot you. Okay. There you go. Keep going. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah, should have kept going. Instead I was, I was standing still going underneath forward. The thing. I was, I was holding down forward <laughs> all the way. <laughs> Ooh. Is that an infinite boost? I guess so. That's handy. Huh. Neat. I don't know. I, I think that a lot of these battle royale games are just kind of tacked on. A like, lot of them are, and, and that's they should die, and they're going to die out of the market. I don't think they are though. No? No. I think people are going to play them because they have the name Battle Royale, and that's the current popular hotness. And, as much as I hate to say it, as a fan of the marketplace, if they stay, if people keep buying into it, then apparently that's what the people want to put their money into. But, see, that's the thing. Like, that doesn't mean it's a good business practice for the longevity of the marketplace. Like, we've had video game crashes in the past. And it worries me that that's going to happen again in the future if we keep up these good practices. Oh, we're definitely going to get a video game crash again. In the it sucks. And, and it's, yeah, it's going to suck. But I don't think it's going to be because of Battle Royale. No, but it's a factor. Sure. I'm not saying Battle Royale are 100% going to crash the market. But when people are just pushing out games like this, it's definitely a leading factor in it. It's not that. Uh, it is that one. Yep. No. Oh, Every both them bridge do. we've come across has done that. And my camera was stuck like that for a while, so that was fun. All right. I know. I like the concept of the Battle Royale. Uh, I do, too. I, just, I, I think it's a cool game mode when it's games done have well. Not, I don't know that I've played a game that has done it well. None of them have. But, again, apparently they've done it well enough for a lot of people to enjoy. We're dying a lot. Yeah. Yeah, I am. Don't die, Peter. I'll keep that in mind. I have to restart the level. Peter, Wee. don't do it. I don't know. I feel like people are jumping onto early access games a bit too early and investing a lot of time in them, which is giving developers a reason to not finish their games in a timely manner because they're getting money already. Sure. And they actually don't have a reason to because people have already bought their game and there's no reason to finish the game off because they're not going to get another big payday once the game releases, you know? Right. Uh, early access is great when it's, like... A small company doing a labor of love. Yeah. And when people actually use it to um, help the game develop. Half the time people just get on so they can play the game early and they don't submit bug reports or help the developers out in any way. Right. I guess money helps. But. Money helps a lot. Money is probably one of the biggest factors in making a game. Well, I think it's the biggest factor in making a game. Yeah. You got this. Well, You're definitely mainly full more. health this time. Yeah, we're gonna let that happen. Wait for my camera to actually be usable again. All right, so there's Over one here. more turn and one more fall. Yeah, there we I go. I think there's another one falling in a second, actually. I don't think there's anything above you right now. No? Okay. Yeah, you're good. The last one's right here. I think you just hug the sidewalk and just run right, right through. Maybe. Okay. Yep. Okay. We did I'm it! Just gonna jump through. Fuck Yay. tails! <sighs> sure. Let's keep hopping about like that. That seems a thing. I gotta do better next time. No, we don't. <laughs> we really don't. <laughs> 
this game is so <laughs> all right we're gonna give peter janky. a little break from this game because he's getting a little frustrated we're, we're gonna first give our chows some special loving are we yeah give him some loving peter okay go give sure. him sure you have a bunch of creatures in there i think now probably hey buddy Oh, maybe the creatures despawn once you leave. Maybe. Yeah, they definitely do. All I want right Why now... Why do you not let me pick you up? Oh! Yeah, you can cycle through with the white blood. Oh. Huh. Peter. Neat. Peter. Hey, you said that I should give it love. Peter. There you go. Oh. And Make one of them wear the hat. I want one of them to wear a shell. Just keep giving it to him until I put it on. Sure. You. Wear it, you. Oh no. Why? Why don't? It's because no. you, uh, you started petting him, so it stopped the animation. Oh, uh, okay. Put it on. Put it on, you fucker. Nope. Keep giving it to him. Force it. Sure. Here you go. You got this, buddy. Go the, behind you. <sighs> yeah. Here you go. Put it on. Lock over here. You're literally the worst chow in the world. Here you go. I spent anything over here? Hours nope. and hours playing this fucking mini game back in the day. Why? I love I love just stuff like this. I guess he's not gonna do it. Here you go. Um, I love management games, and this is kind of a management game. I tend to enjoy management games. I guess part of it is I'm approaching this now in 2018. How does that have anything to do with it? Like, even just moving around feels awful in Chow World. So I think you're overly critical of old movement mechanics. Like, they're bad, but that's kind of what we had back in the day. I'm aware it's what we had back in the day. The thing is, I'm looking at... Unfortunately, I am looking at it from today's right, perspective. Give up on that. Go do a Chow race, and we'll call it a day. Okay. Oh, that's a high jump. Yeah, he's Tails. He's the Luigi of the Sonic universe. I kind of wish I had more... Okay, so Chow Race. I kind of wish I had a Tails platforming section that didn't involve no, a mech. you're always in a mech in Tails. I, I agree. I wish... We're going to race. Uh, okay. I wish that this game... like I like that it's frac fractioned out as much as it is. You, I guess. <laughs> With a single run. Oh, this is going to be a shit show. Probably. I don't. He's picking you the levels. Crab pool. He's not good at swimming. So this <laughs> maybe not be the best level for him. You should pick any of the levels. <laughs> yeah, that's true. We're going to lose regardless. Okay. There's no chance of us winning this. Do I do anything or do we do You can watch? cheer them on and that's pretty much it. Okay. <laughs> Where's your idiot? I think that was mine at the very beginning. Was it? Yeah. The one that oh, yeah. actually has like animal bits. Oh, oh, that drains his stamina, I guess. Yeah, I guess. Oh, he's winning though. Yeah. Peter. Peter. Did the crabs attack? I don't know. Okay, I. We're just watching a bunch of small creatures drown. Yeah. That's literally all this is. That's what it looks like. Um. <laughs> do I do I do something? Do no, I... it's it's purely simulation, based off your stats. So right. normally you have your chat bit like max out a little bit more so this goes a lot faster and you just destroy these guys sure <laughs> considering we've given him two animals and a space cookie hit here's damn again see what happens you just get really sad there you go oh he just gets really sad i guess i like the chat designs i think they're cute yeah they're cute they uh remind me of something i'm not sure what in a way, they kind of remind me of the um, Dragon Quest slimes, but with a body. Yeah, they have the same kind of shape, teardrop head thing going yeah. on. I wouldn't be surprised if that was part of the um, the initial design process. Okay. <laughs> You're so far behind. <laughs> oh, we. Oh, you can catch up on land. Oh no, that's the end yeah. Of the race. I think that's the finish line. They're all so happy and not drowning a terrible, terrible drowning death. Yeah. This is kind of depressing. Yeah. I, um... <laughs> can 
I wish there was a fast forward button on that. Nah, it's fine. Does your character even get shown? No, he's clapping for the other ones. No, oh, that's good. Good on you for being. We're a not going to do that game. No. No. No, I'm never trying that again. Never again. And in fact, we're quitting. All yeah. right, guys. So we're starting up a new format this week. We've seen this is the Friday episode. Might as well tell them about it. New format? Well, just the fact that if they enjoy this series, we'll continue more. Oh, yeah, sure. Yeah. Otherwise, this was Peter's look at uh, Sonic Adventure 2, which he absolutely loved. Every second of it. Yep. 100% Not a Peter single loved. bad thing to say about this game. <laughs> it was a perfect game. There is nothing... I can go up and down? I think that was just you hitting the wall. Oh, yeah. neat. Yeah. Uh, yeah, no, there was not it, a single bad thing about this game. It surprised it me they gave him game. flying physics if he's never uses them at any level. Yep. It's strange. But yeah, so we're going to be looking at this, and if, if people like it, we'll continue. We... If not, we'll go on to our next game. See, this is fine. This actually controls well. I feel happy with this. But this is not at any point in the game no. outside of this stupid area that makes no matter. This price is the most important part of the game, Peter. How so? Because this is the most fun part of the game. Look at these You haven't unlocked the hero garden yet either, which is really cool. What's a hero? Do I want to know what a hero no, garden is? No, don't okay. worry about it. Once, once they go to either side, dark or light, yeah. you unlock a corresponding garden for that side, and they migrate to that. Neat. Yeah, this the, isn't a light area. This is a neutral area. This is area? the neutral area. Sure. The light area has like more radiant lightness and a big, a bigger waterfall and all that stuff. And the dark area is all dark and depressing. That's cool. Sure. It's it's fun. All right. Well, we'll see you guys later. Yeah. That was the week with with week Sonic Adventure two. I did it. Yes. I did a thing. Yes. Yes, you did. I'm running on no sleep. This is true. <laughs> <laughs>